So in this video, we're going to look at NAN, or not a number in JavaScript. So NAN represents a value which is not a number. NAN is actually a numerical value, but it is used to represent anything which cannot be used as a number. Due to the fact that NAN is not a valid number, you cannot perform calculations with it. So let's look at some examples of this. We'll start by adding 5 to NAN. This returns NAN. We get the same result if we try to multiply NAN with 3. And also, if we try to divide a value, in this case, 0, with NAN. You would also get NAN returned if you tried to perform an invalid calculation, such as 0 by 0. So it's worth noting, with this example, that when you perform this calculation on a calculator, you receive a message, not a number. You can assign NAN to a variable, just like you would with any other value. To do this, you can either assign NAN directly to the variable, or you can use the number property, NAN. Both of these are the same. NAN itself is a property of the global object, so it's available to use directly and from anywhere. Let's look at an example of this. So we'll create a variable using let called one. We'll assign NAN to this. Now, let's console log the variable. We get NAN returned. Let's create another variable called 2, and this time assign number dot NAN. When we console log 2 out, we get NAN returned. You may encounter NAN in your code as an error. Some examples of these include trying to pass an invalid number such as 1, which starts with a letter. I'll use a console log and use the parseInt method, which would pass a value, but I'll start the value with the letter A. So I'll use the string A, 1, two, three. When this runs, I get NAN returned. Another example would be trying to perform invalid calculations such as with undefined. So let's try to perform the calculation one plus undefined. Again, we get NAN returned because this is not a valid calculation. The last example we'll look at is passing an invalid number to a mathematical operator. So the square root method only accepts positive numbers. Let's try using this with a negative number. So I say math dot square root, and then I pass in negative 11. I get NAN returned. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe for more content.